zoo. We go to the zoo every year on Thanksgiving. Probably just my grandma's house. Going home, that's pretty special. I'm going to Hawaii. I'm going to Portland to visit my brother. Okay. Phoenix. My parents' house. <laughs> I'm going home. Home. I think this Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving is very new to me because I'm an inter, uh, international student. I'm actually going to New Mexico to go visit some family up there, so I'm really excited. My grandma's house with all my cousins and my family's coming in all over. I hope I'm going home. I don't know if I can. If she doesn't go home, I don't know. My family's down in California, but I'll just have Thanksgiving up here with some friends and make the best of it. Back home. Down to the valley. I'm going to this guy's house. I'm from upstate New York, so it's gonna be good. Yeah, <laughs> I'm excited. I'm most thankful for my family and how they're always gonna support me unconditionally. My dad. Family. Clean water. All the opportunities that like I've been given in my life. Me getting an education. Family and them allowing me to come here. Friends and family. Oh, that's cheesy. Be alive. No, I don't know what I'm thankful for. Everything. All my friends. I'm a film major. I want to be in film, so it's a it's a tough industry to want to be in. And I'm very thankful to have a lot of friends and family there to support me in it. Being in one of those. Be able to appreciate life. A, a nice heated place with good friends to live. Being out here and being able to um, experience a completely different lifestyle and getting my education. My family here that I get to call it here at NAU. So my mom. Maybe like living this life and just being in it. Friends and family lately, they're being like really supportive and it's tough to be at school sometimes, so they're doing really good. You know, being able to express myself. Just having somewhere to go on Thanksgiving because a lot of people don't even have a place or a family. Well, I think I'm most thankful for just the friends I've made at the school and the connections and just the family vibe I get from the people I've known. Spanish professor. I am most thankful for Paul Helford. He is my, one of the professors for the creative media and film department. James Joyner. He's just a rat teacher. I love him. Um, Hawkins. Professor Hawkins for sure. He's super chill, super down to earth. Professor uh, Robin Martin. She's the sweetest girl ever. She's just a gem. Wow, there's so many. Julie Henson. She's an electrical engineering professor. I really appreciate all the help that she's provided me throughout the years. Buck Sanford. Robert Sanford. I am most thankful for Dr. Koss. Even though I'm failing his class, he's an amazing teacher. <laughs> My anthropology professor, um, Dr. Frederick Lampy. Shout out to him. Professor Fowler. Professor Fowler. My English professor from last year, Masha, she's been such a great help. She's helped me through a lot of them. She still helps me now, even though I'm out of her class. Melissa Armstrong and Bridget Barrow. Uh, I got two, Eric Yordy and Margaret Dumpy, so uh, at the College of Business, so they're always able to stop by, say hi to me, and things like that, so get, get to be able to keep a good relationship with them. I will take with me when I start teaching my operations management professor, uh, Professor Hopeful. He's super cool. He always like has awesome like presentations for class, always has in-class activities, so he really does good at like making everyone actually enjoy class. I feel like all of them because like they're just portraying all of their knowledge onto us and like that's really respectable. But I'm an education major so I respect teachers greatly. Couple places. Um, Lake Mary is a really great place that I'm really thankful for. It's just beautiful. It's zen. Dutch Bros. Just like the forest. Honestly I'm just kind of just thankful for the whole city honestly because it's so pretty. I like Buffalo Park. The movie theaters probably spend too much time there, so. <laughs> La Fonda's. I love La Fonda so much. Their food is amazing. Lookout point up by Lowell Observatory. I think it's really cool for people to just go up and kick it at. You know, you can just drive your car up there with friends or you can go by yourself. Cool little look out of Flagstaff, you know what I mean? And so it's just kind of like you and the town. And it's just like you get to see like the vast, like just how big, you know, uh, the forest is and just how far it goes out. And so it kind of like puts things into perspective, you know, because the town kind of seems small, but when you're like up there, you know, you kind of get to see like everything from like the campus to downtown. Like uh, Humphreys, you know, it's beautiful up there and just uh, my home. I, I really love downtown. I love all the businesses and coffee shops and restaurants. Monsoons, right where? Like the forest, dude, of course. Like all the Aspen, like the Lockett Meadow, that's the best place ever. I, I know that's basic, but like, <laughs> have you been there? It's amazing. I'm most thankful for my friends at NAU because they're always here. Definitely the teachers. The teachers are great teachers. 
for the education that I'm getting. Like, I think it's a great opportunity and like I take advantage of every like learning opportunity that is provided here and like that's what I'm just thankful My sorority, for sure. The community and the location of it, it's a beautiful town and the college is increasing in size and getting a little bit better. My roommates and knowing that I go to a school that genuinely wants me to succeed in everything that I do and really just uh, practice your passion. At NEU I'm most thankful for my professors who pay attention and you know they care about us and they care about where our progress is. Um, uh, Pure Jacks, I'm a mentor for Pure Jacks so there's definitely been uh, kept me here at NEU and definitely helped me excel. I think the entire environment I found here. Thank you. Yeah, I'm thankful for all the opportunities I've gotten stay students so it was a lot more doable but like I have a lot of good connections now. I'm an English major and I love the faculty in my program. Man, cool people everywhere. The opportunities that I had. Yeah I would definitely say the community, like the people, the teachers, the students here. I really love my major and my program. I'm in education and we have a really good structure here for that. Weather. I mean it hasn't rained lately but it's usually known for having a lot of rain and a lot of snow. I'm an RA so I really love like hanging out with all my residents, living on campus, like getting that kind of opportunity to like hang out here and be such a big positive impact here. Not physics. <laughs> yeah, that's, sure. that's for sure. And I'm also grateful for the friends that I've made here. Um, they've also helped me, you know, adjust to the whole lifestyle here and stuff. So thank you for that. The town flag has pretty cool. The weather's nice. Because of any of you and the club that I'm in was able to join, I got to work on a film set for an internship. Um, so that was a lot of fun, really a great experience. I think just what I've gotten to experience here and the overall 